Welcome back. I'm your host, Brothgar, and today I've got some more oxygen not included. Now, as you can see here, I have created my Mad Scientist campaign, which is a nice blank space today. And what I'm going to be trying to do is coming up with a very efficient method of creating steam. So this whole base is just set up to do experiments. Whatever experiments, whatever sort of things you leave down in the comment section below, I'm going to kick it off, though, with a steam waterfall. That's what I want to try to do. A couple of things that I think are going to be real key to this. One, I'm going to use large batteries because they're hot enough to create steam and the other characteristic about trying to turn stuff into steam is to actually let it drip so creating drips and then waterfalls that batteries are included on should work pretty good I think that'll hopefully create some steam so before I go ahead and execute this let's head on over here to the base planner and come up with a blueprint boom all right, so here's the blueprint, guys. On the top left here, I have my vent, and then that'll go past a battery. Since it's dripping through the air, it will then come in contact for a little bit with that battery. Hopefully, some of that will be turning to steam. If at some that point, the liquid will then continue on over here to the next battery, to the next battery, to the next battery, and so on and so forth, hopefully creating steam all the way down. Uh, if it's still liquid at the bottom, it'll then get pumped back up to the vent, and start the cycle again. That is hooked up to a power switch, so it doesn't have to be running constantly. The idea, though, is to create as much steam as possible. If steam here will rise, which it should because it's very hot and therefore also a gas, so it should go through all this gas permeable tiles, will then get hopefully back up here to the top and be able to vent on over here to the right. And this is a condensing field. So this is a bunch of mesh tiles. The idea is that it's hopefully going to be cool enough and they'll then come in contact with the gas itself cooling it down, creating a liquid, which at that point it'll rain because it'll be a liquid, and this will be our clean water chamber over here. So contaminated over here, clean over there. We'll see if that works. I'm not 100% sure if the gas will be able to get past this stuff or if I'm going to have to spread these batteries out, but we'll see right there. I have got it all planned out, so it's 28 tiles tall, not very, it's not too tall, and we also got some power switches if I want to turn things on or off. Let's see if it works. Maybe the steam waterfall is a real legitimate thing. Scale of one to ten, how many? How much do you think this is gonna work? I'm about a seven. I think it's. I think there's a chance it's gonna work. Look at this. If I just use W, woo! That's fun. Hey, that's pro tip right there. All right, all the builds queued up. Let's hit the time lapse. Uh, you have a way out. You can get up. You can be free. See? Mima. Mima's gonna die because she's stuck. Okay, you're just holding on to that battery for dear life. It's gonna be the last thing you ever do. Oh no, now they're zapping. They're zapping, Mima. You're gonna get shocked to death. Oh no. Now she's, she's just adding something to the pool already. Oh, and some vomit. Oh my gosh. Mima's just losing it. I guess I would lose it too if I was just like completely stuck holding on to a battery that's about to turn into like a steam generating monster hopefully speaking of which I've got a lot of contaminated water this has been a great plan I even got a little puffed working away here it goes I love it somewhere along the way I messed up my blueprint whatever one piece of the puzzle that's all you need one Thank you. My gosh, that's all. That's all you're gonna give me. Just. <laughs> oh, I don't know what to, what to do with these guys. It's all right. So now we need some more manual generation, and I'm merciless. So you're getting nothing but wheels with zero decoration. Want to deconstruct my stuff? I'm stupid duplicates. Mad scientists have gone insane. I guess that would. It's inevitable, right? Okay, so apparently that wire bridge just does not work. Which means that stupid pump's gonna have to run constantly. Oh well, you know, you try to plan for things, but sometimes... Alpha gets the better of you. Alright, so who's ready to see if this steam waterfall is gonna work? Cause I sure am. My poor base is... I mean, people just vomited all over it. 
and uh, Mima died. So this is for Mima. Let's turn on the pump. We're gonna enable this sucker. Come on now. All right, look what's going on here. We now got water running, and it is really raining down. Come on, give me some steam, baby. Give me some steam. Hey, you know what I'm seeing there? I'm seeing a little bit of steam. And here's something that's interesting. So as this stuff is raining in there, you can see that it's kind of, it's making it this far, but it's really not making it all the way down here. Sometimes the water does, sometimes it doesn't. And these overheated morbs are gonna die. That'll be good. You can die, morbs. I hopefully should see up here is some steam. If uh, Castella decides to stop beating up my crap. Oh my gosh, I gotta repair all this junk. All this junk up in here. Come on now. All right, so so far that's making. Uh, if I maybe if I look at gas, contents 10 kilograms, but only some of it's coming out. Well, what if I turn this up to 100? Then what's gonna happen? Yeah, look at that flow. All right, so now that is really pumping it all. <laughs> it's really water falling. The thing is, I'm not seeing it sort of connect with this battery. I kind of wanted to see a pool. Ah, uh, true to form, Bubbles is on the Hydra fan. Literally in the last uh, last episode, all she did is ran that thing constantly. She even like ran it so much that she died. Her one job was to cook. Gonna do it. All right, so this this really isn't working. Like I am getting a little bit of liquid here and there, but I'm not getting steam. I'm just expecting a little bit more. So what I think I'm gonna do is rearrange this so that. It diverts a little bit more back and forth. Maybe I gotta just tone this down a little bit. Nope, yeah, it's just not working. All right, let's disable that. All right, so here we are with the steam waterfall 2.0. I've made the little gas permeable tiles a little bit more forward. And I think what I'm seeing here is a little bit, maybe a little steam, maybe? I saw steam, I saw it for a moment. And what's this? There it is. I saw a, a wisp of steam. There's another wisp of steam. Looks like this is starting to work here. Ha ha. And I guess you needed that water. Okay. Out of all the places to go, that's an interesting spot to get water. All right, so we're going to be pumping in lots of water now. Come on, I want to see some steam. Look at this liquid. Boom. It's dripping in big. It's going all over the place. Okay, we're going to enable these. Get some of these drips going so it's not so much. Obviously, the full flow there of a whole pump is too much for what I got because I'm building up liquid down there. However, you can clearly see that there's areas of steam now. So this is actually working, but the real question is, am I gonna actually get cool stuff over here? Gotta get some nice cool. So there was some water that was already sucked up just to go make some mush bars. Can't have enough mush bars. I am actually getting water though, and it started right here. All right, so I'm gonna break down, and I'm gonna try to use these guys here. Thermal regulators, gas pumps, filter, that sort of deal. All right, now everybody get on their wheel and start making some power here. I wanna see steam. I wanna see fresh water. Come on guys, run faster. Charge them batteries. We'll turn off everything. I wanna see this work. Now you don't get to go to sleep. Get back to work. Come on, guys. All you gotta do is charge that battery up. Yeah. They put in an all-nighter and look at this. Now we finally got some power. All right, I'll tell you what. We'll make a coal generator. Somebody gonna deliver something to this coal generator? It's like priority level nine. Hello. Don't be so stupid duplicates. Uh, seriously. <laughs> I only need somebody to deliver coal, but I can't get anybody to do it. See, now they'll pay attention to this one, but they won't pay attention to that one. All right, fine. Oh my gosh. Like, I don't know what to do with people in this game. Sometimes it just... <laughs> uh, it's an alpha, right? Okay, so what, I've, what I am doing is creating... I can see steam here, but it's not making its way back up. So maybe the steam waterfall is just a terrible idea. I want to see some steam move through here. Just a little bit. See, there it is. It's moving. Steam, steam. It is making steam, but it's as if the steam's just never, ever going to get back up. 
So let me just give it some more water. Somebody please. Now let's see here. Now that we can see the steam, let's see what happens. All right, so we're flooding the crap out of this. And if we look at the temperature, it's definitely hot in here. Like it's way hot. All right, well, I've spent more than enough time trying to see if this idea of a steam waterfall would work. And as it turns out, it doesn't. I thought it was kind of a creative idea. I thought it had merit, which I think it still might. But currently, the way it works right now, it's not working. So, that's one idea down. I'm sure there's more to come. If you got some ideas for me, go ahead and leave them down there in the comment section below. And I'll see if I can get to it here. I think this was fun. It took a long time. <laughs> so I gotta find ways of making it a little bit faster. But, um, I don't know. We'll find a really efficient way to do steam. You know, something creative, something fancy. This just wasn't it. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Stay awesome. If I've earned your subscription, then thank you so much for that. Peace. Brothgar out.